straightallday.com. Here, out of the corner, I'm going to give a hard jab, step towards the middle, and attack the baseline. I give a spin move off the baseline, back towards the middle, and you see I'm fading a little bit as I go off the glass with the mid-range shot. This will be about it, either anywhere from 10 to 15 feet where I'm shooting from right now, but of course, you can adjust this to be closer or further, whatever works for you in your situation. You can also do this from in front of the basket, the top of the key area. You're not limited by anything. The only thing you're limited by... When you watch these drills, you don't have to do them exactly as I do them, the same spots, the same distance, or anything. As long as it's legal, you can do any move you want. You are only limited by what you believe you cannot do. So a lot of people ask me, well, can I do this and that? You don't have to ask me. You can just do it. You can take anything you see here and adjust it for your own game. That's what you should be doing anyway. You can't copy other people because you're not them. Your circumstances are not theirs. Your body's not theirs. Your game situations are not theirs. Here on the other side, right side of the wing is I'm using the USA first step here as I rip that ball just gotta make sure the ball leaves my hand before my pivot foot leaves the floor attack the baseline spin towards the middle and you see a slight fade as I'm kinda of fading towards the foul line there and I'm gonna go off the glass with the shot you can go nothing but net if it works for you thumbs up to like this drill work on your game